Hello guys, um, today I'm going to show you how to make a simple player TNT cannon. It does not shoot TNT, but it can if you make it. Um, but, yeah, mainly it just shoots a player, and it shoots it straight up in the air. But, yeah. So, yeah. I'm just going to start building it here. Like, this is, this is the base of it. It's, it just has a little um, plus cut out, just the same plus as that blaze spawner video that I made, like in the very beginning. But um, okay, so enough of that. But I just made this iron because it looks awesome, if if you know what I mean. But yeah, um, and then you're just gonna want to put water in there, and then just put redstone around here. I made it iron. Well, for just to make it look awesome, and so that, um, so that I know where to place this. Even though I already do, this just it helps. But yeah, so you're gonna want a block there and a lever on it or button. But I like to do lever because since it stays on, it just it's safer basically. But yeah, so put a redstone there, and then you're gonna want to right click on all the redstone, and this is gonna be your second layer. And then, whoops, um, okay, and then you're just going to want to build a little, what am I doing, um, here, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm forgetful all the time, wait, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just, I'm a little sick, so I can't think straight, but yeah, so, if you caught what I did, instead of redstone there, I put a block of iron, and then in like this corner, but over here, I put a block with redstone, and then in this corner, I put a block with redstone, and so that just builds it up, and then I'll just do that just for, oh wait, no. <laughs> okay, so, third level. I'll just build it without the redstone, because, like, without placing it on the redstone, because I don't feel like placing it on the redstone, I guess. But, yeah, so, hopefully this will not blow up, but once you have this, you're going to want to, um, you're going to want to do something like this. There are better ways to hook these up, but this is just a basic way for, like, if you're new to redstone, or just minecraft in general. But yeah, so let's test it by flipping the lever and make sure that every redstone comes on so that we don't have a TNT blow up. But yeah, so once that works, now you can switch to a button. Because, yeah, the, the lever just is for safety so that you know all the redstone works. And so now, you have it loaded with all 12 TNT. Let's see, 4, 4, 4. It's 12. If I'm smart at math, I would know that. But, okay, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to right click the button, of course, and then you're going to want to hold your space bar. And then, we look at my Y. It got up to about 300. And then I'm falling, I'm falling. We okay, I'm at the ground. But yeah, I'm going to do that again, but in F5 mode, just so that you can get, like, the concept of how high and how fast it goes up. Whoops. Yeah, but you're going to want to be careful with this. Okay, so F5, and then F3. Okay, so, there it goes. So, watch the ground. Woo! See how fast that goes? It's crazy. Yeah, but, okay, so, yeah, that's a pretty good player cannon, and if you, like, hook up, like, um, repeaters for, like, seven repeaters, and then it goes up, and then it hits a TNT, like, right whenever the TNT's falling, it shoots it up, or you can do it with sand, with a piston that pushes it. Just, I might make a video showing how to do that, but, yeah, so, I hope you guys liked this, and, um, 
I hope you guys like want more videos. This is weird. My head is moving to my voice. Lol. Okay, so bye guys. Okay, that was really weird. I'm never doing that again. Bye.